that Claire lacrosse game, USC versus Mount Lebanon. Here announcing the starters midfield. On the field, we have uh, number eight, Brandon Serma, number 22, Alex Kish, number 18, uh, Matt Barkas, number 33, Craig Morgan, starting midfield, number three, Matt Hedeus, and number 17, Bobby Snyder. At attack, we have number six, Trevor Yearly, number 21, uh, Dave Zangrelli, and number nine, Brent, Brian Gorder. Oh, and at goalie we have number 13, Travis Nacy. We have a legal procedure on black while bringing up the ball. Craig Morgan playing defense at number 32 for Mid Lebanon. Pass over number 18, being played by Bobby Snyder. Bobby in pass around the offensive end from Mount Lebanon. Craig Morgan playing defense. Shot, white ball. Ball being brought in by Mount Lebanon behind the upper St. Clair net. Ball at X coming around the net. Pass. Behind the back shut. Wide. White ball. Ball being brought in by number 22 from Mount Lebanon. It's coming around the net. Spin. Good defense by Upper St. Clair. High shot. Gone wide. Pat, hurry up. Ball being brought in on the sideline by Mount Lebanon. Pass over, but number four. Pass back up to the top to 18 from Mount Lebanon. Ball back to over to the middle. Crashing the net. Nice check by number 18, Matt Barkas. And I'm joined by Pat Welch. How you doing, Pat? I'm pretty good. I mean, this delicious food here at the high school stadium. That's good. Ball being brought down by number three, Matt Hideas. Pass behind to Trevor Yuley. Oh, and he falls down a little bit there. Good defense by Mount Lebanon, but not quite good enough. Bounce pass. Shot by Brent Gorder goes high. Black ball. Ball being brought in by Trevor. Pass to Matt. Shot. Saved by Mount Lebanon goalie. Another shot. Gone behind. Ball picked up by Mount Lebanon defender. Being brought up on the far sideline. Pass yeah. behind to X. Good defense by Serma. Serma passing it up top. Or not Serma. Mount Lebanon passing it up top. Good defense by Bobby Snyder. Pass back to 27. Looking to set up a play. Beat shot and a save by Travis Nacy. That's good. a good save. Hmm, tell me about it. Ball being brought up the near sideline by Matt Tadeus. They slowing it down. Pass it over to Morgan. Bring it into the box. Ball back to Morgan. Back over to Tadeus. Ball being passed around. Back to Yuli at X. He's looking for a pass. No one there. Good defense by Mount Lebanon. Gorder, going one on one here. Mount Lebanon picking it up. Ten oh. Moore trying to play some deep. And batted down by, I think that's Trevor Yearly. Oh, oh just shot wide. It. And that's white ball.
All right, ball being brought in by Mount Lebanon defense. Back over to the goalie. Ball coming up the center. Upper St. Clair riding. Oh, left his man up in the middle of the field. It's not a good clear. Got Leva having it back up to 30. Bobby Schneider playing some defense. That's a good D, shuffling his feet. Mount Lebanon can't seem to do anything with this ball. What do you got to say about that? Yeah, I think this uh, Panther defense is playing pretty good right now. Now I think now that they have uh, Travis Nace, they'll be playing a lot better. What do you think? Yeah, Tra Travis is out with the knee injury, but now he's back. I think he's a key ingredient to this Panther defense. Hmm. I agree, I agree. Nice pick up by Travis. Clear over to number 41, Mike Shuley. Turns on the afterburn, isn't flying downfield. Shuley at the 15, looking for a pass. Passes it back up to Hideas. Back to Shuley. Looking for a cutter. Crash to the goal. No one's going. Mike Shuley at X right now. <laughs> Just going back and forth. Oh, he beats his man. Pass out. Sangrelli. Uh, goalie with a nice There's save. A collision there. Panthers playing some good defense on Mount Lebanon right now. Goal Long defense. pass. Yep. Oh, and missed. Missed by Mount Lebanon. That will be a Panther ball, I believe. We have, uh, I believe that's Ben Guest come on the field. Pass over to Alex Kish. Bobbled. Oh, a nice pass, number eight, Brandon Serma. Back to Shuley, coming up the middle of the field. Shuley with the ball on the near sideline, looking for a pass. Pass over to Mike Andreghi. Andreghi trying to drive to the net. Andreghi running behind the net, looking for a pass, shot! Oh, out, hit the back of the net. Still a 0-0 game, folks. With uh, six minutes and 15 seconds left in the first quarter. Mount yes. Lebanon trying to set up their offense. St. Clair's is playing some good D right now. We have Sermon playing defense. Mm, Sermon, a new addition to the team after coming from the hockey team. I believe so. Hmm. Ooh, Trevor Yearly coming up and picking up that ground ball. Bring it back around to X. Trevor looking for a pass. Oh, he falls down behind the crease, still has the ball. Finally knocked out of his stick. Mount Lebanon's goalie with the ball. You can't, you can't talk at all. Oh, oh, Whammy. what a hit. Whammy. I believe our cameraman thinks that's the biggest hit he's ever seen in his the life. Panther history, in fact. Ball coming over the sideline, and that's Mount Lebanon's that's ball. Schneiders. Yeah, I think it's the biggest hit I've ever seen. Good opinion. <laughs> Yet not true. Bobby Snyder playing some defense. Oh, bad pass by Mount Lebanon going out of bounds. Panther That'll ball. That'll be a C ball.
Craig Morgan dropping the ball. Lebo. Lebo's uh, closing it, pass it up to number 40, Mount Lebanon. Nice check by Percent Claire. Pick up by Travis Nacy, the goalie. Ball caught by number 99, Ben Guest. It's getting over and it's Ball dropped. Down. Mount Lebanon going to slow it down a little bit. Mount Lebanon just can't seem to get anything working here. Upper St. Clair's defense is shutting him down. Cashman plays some defense at X. Good checks there. Man coming in on for Mount Lebanon. Coming right through the middle. Pick the pass. Oh, and he's knocked down by Ben Gask. Now Lemonin bringing in the ball against Matt Barkus. Now Ben Gess gonna play some solid defense there, if you ask me. Yes, yeah, very good. Well, you try to put a move, and he's got nope, he, he's got nothing. What a oh, save by Travis Nacy. Stuffed. As stuffed I like, like to a call Thanksgiving it. turkey. They set up the clear. Matt Barker's with the ball over the 10 yard line. Oh, you see. Bad pass, yet I believe they still capitalize on defense here. Mount Lemon just can't get anything working against this strong upper St. Clair D. Yeah, about three minutes left in the first quarter. Number 27 in, 27 bringing the ball in against Bobby Snyder. Bobby Schneider picking up the ball. I believe he's one of the best midfielders I've ever seen in this whole entire world. Indeed. Ball number 18. Mm. Good D by the Panthers. They just can't do anything. Once they get in, they just bring it back out. <clears throat> Number 32 with the ball, over the top of the box, trying to play some DM Ahideas. Pass the middle, shot, score, Mount Lebanon. That's not good. What you gonna do? Scores now, upper percent Claire zero, Mount Lebanon one. About two minutes left in the first quarter. About to go on a face off right here. I believe that's number 33, Craig Morgan, taking the face off for the Panthers. Number 17, Bobby Snyder, near side. Number three, Matt Hedas on the far side. Ball picked up by Morgan. I don't think he loses too many of those. I don't think he loses too many of those. Mm, he hasn't, he yeah. hasn't lost many. Has the ball up top. Pass down to Trevor. Looking for a pass, can't find it. Brings around the net. Shot blocked by Mount Lebanon's defense. Ooh, ball down. Some good defense. Seen better. That the moment's pretty good though.
Morgan's going to bring the ball in behind the net. I don't think you see that much, but uh, hopefully it might work. Hopefully. Morgan bringing the ball around. Pushed it out by Mount Lebanon's defense. A little underhand pass. pass to number nine, Brad Gorder. Pass back out to Fackenthal. Looking. Can't find it. Passes it back to Trevor. Morgan back with the ball up top. Looks like he's going to put a move on Mount Lebanon's D. Shot saved by Mount Lebanon. Picked back up by Trevor. Tracker. Being pushed out. It's going to be White's ball. It's only 28 seconds remaining in the first quarter. Mount Lebanon's going to try to get the ball down and get one last shot. Long pass by Mount Lebanon. Missed. Just off the mark. Picked up by Andreggi. He's turning on the wheels. Little. Right back in the box. They better capitalize here. Only have five seconds left. You gotta shoot. He's, he's gotta take it. Oh. Nice shot, but it's saved by Mount Lebanon goalie. We're gonna take a break here. At the end of the first quarter, the score is Mount Lebanon one, Hyper St. Clair nothing. We're here at the start of the second quarter. Craig Morgan taking the face off. Matt Davis is near side and Bobby Snyder on the far side. How's it going? I'm Pat Welch here. This is Steve Donovan. We're your announcers today. Ball picked up by Bobby Snyder. Checked out of his stick, but Matt Davis picks it up. Pass back to Morgan. Ball to Fackenthal. Upper St. Clair passing around. I think he might shoot. No, I just takes, puts right back outside. Pass, passing around to Ely. I think that's Ely. Mm -hmm. Sure is. One of the best tackling I've ever seen. Indeed, indeed. Spinning left and right. Juking that Mount Lebanon defender right out of his shoes. I believe that that's what they call a breaking his ankles. In, in fact, it is. You are nice correct. Nice shot by that. I don't know. I don't know how to Fackenthal. Oh, thank you. And he's hit out of bounds. That's Upper St. Clair ball. Upper St. Clair ball. Upper St. Clair ball. <laughs> Ball being brought in by Matt Davis near side. Let's see if they can capitalize here. Upper St. Clair needs a goal being down one. This has been and a close game for first Good quarter. D by number 44 for Mount Lebanon. Nice check right there. But Mount Upper St. Clair still with the ball. Ball being passed around. Back at X to Ely. Ely trying to look for a pass. No one's there. It is to, oh, Fackenthal. my bad. <laughs> Back over to Fackenthal, far side. Ely still looking for a pass, spinning. Pick up by Gorder, shot, uh, another save. Oh, Mount Lebanon's got a fast break. Let's see if Morgan can get Oh, uh, Morgan's got the wheels, makes it back on D. Shot, score, Mount Lebanon. Number four from Mount Lebanon. That must have been going 100 miles an hour. Yeah, I'd say about 85. Scores no, two Mount Lebanon, Panthers nothing. It's about 10 minutes left in the second quarter. About to take the face off. Got Craig Martin going to take it. They look like a timeout. We're going to take a break here. Okay, we're back. 
Oh, we're back. Been back for about 10 seconds. Oh, I didn't know that. Caught me off my guard. Morgan at the center X taking the face off for the Panthers. Driving. Oh, I think that's the first face off Morgan's lost in about three games. That's huge. It's real big. He needed that. Bob being passed around by Mount Lebanon. Number two, trying to put a move on Morgan. Can't do it. Morgan's too quick. Even after that severe knee surgery he had earlier this season. Look at that ACL. You would be correct. Yeah, that, that's not stopping him. Doesn't look like it to me. More defense by Morgan. Ball back behind. Oh, and it's dropped by Mount Lebanon. Panthers ball. We're gonna have a. Um, Andre, you gonna come on the field? Clear up field to Serma. Serma's gonna pass in the middle to Hideas. That's good clear. Balls on X with that Trevor Ewing. Trevor behind the net. Ooh, that was close to a ward right there. He's too coming from the net. Pass, shot, score. Ooh, and he draws a penalty. Dave Zangrelli. What a player. With an amazing shot. Scores now about 11 and 2. Panthers 1. That was an exciting goal. One of the best I've seen in a while. We're getting some chance from the uh, Panther players for, for uh, David Zangrelli. It's a good player. There's a penalty on the last play by Mount Lebanon. So went one man in the sidelines for a minute. I believe so. Morgan with the oh Morgan with the face off win. Back to his winning ways. Black ball, of course. Upper St. Clair's is bringing in the ball. I believe that's number three, Matt Hideas. Pete the addition on the now. field is uh, Pete McCann for Dave Zangrelli. Oh, nope, Dave's still on there. I believe they have four tackle on and two middies. Ah, yes they do. Just passing that ball around. Pass. Pitch and catch. Pitch and catch, yeah. Looking for a pass, looking for a shot. Snow one's getting open. Gord is open on the wing. Snow can find him the ball. <coughs> ball over to Gorder. Pass up to Morgan. We better be quick about this. The penalty is almost up. Up shot. Morgan. Oh, nice save by the Mount Lebanon goalie. I believe his stick was checked when he was uh Falling through there. Yeah, might have stopped this shot a little bit. Still a good shot, though. All the power might have been taken out of it. I mean, he's hustling back to play defense. More good defense by the Panthers. Drive the goal, shot missed. Nice save by Travis. It's going to be a white ball behind the net. Mount Lebanon ball. We've got number 32 up top. Bobby Schneider playing some defense. Ball back around to the side. Back behind 12 at the X. 
I love it. I'm still trying to find a man open. Can't find him. He's going to try to put a move on this. Can't do it. This is too quick. Mm. Quick with the checks. Quick with the checks. Ooh, ended up shot and scored by Mount Lebanon. It's disturbing. The score, score is, is Mount Lebanon 3, Panthers 1, with about 6 minutes and 30 seconds left to go. And we have an announcer that likes to cut people off. Hey, people want to hear the announcer. Can't wait for it. I understand. Face off is going to be taken again by Craig Morgan and Snyder and Deus on the lines. Still no possession. And uh, Mount Lebanon wins second face off. Ooh, I'll present Claire Ball. Matt Barker's bringing the ball on the sideline. Matt Barker's a junior captain for the Panthers. He's a pretty good defenseman, if you ask me. One of the best. One of the best. Pass all the way to Serma. Oh, drops it. Yet he can recover by playing some good defense there. And he does. Picked up again by Barkus. Nice cradling. Passes it up. Perfect. Perfect pass to Andreggi coming through the middle. Fast break, Panthers. Shot. Score! Andreggi, top corner. That's one of my favorite types of shots. The quick ones. Cracking the top corner. What a shot. With about six minutes left in the half, Panthers up, down one goal. It's Mount Lebanon three, Panthers two. Slowly cutting off the Mount Lebanon lead. And Morgan again with the face off at the center. And this time it's going to be. Well, still no possession. Uh, one by Mount Lebanon. Mitty's fighting back to play defense. Shot saved by Travis Nacy. Barkus nailing the guy so he can't get that shot off. Nice play back to Ooh. Bobby Snyder. Flag, a flag down. down. That's not good. Pass up to Kish. I believe that's a flag on Mount Lebanon. Mm. Possibly. Not really sure. Nice shot. Oh. Score. Tra Assist by Kish. <laughs> what a shot. Trevor Yeely with his first goal of the game. Beautiful. Beautiful. J just beautiful. Now it's all tied up. Panthers three. Mount Lebanon three. With about five minutes, 12 seconds to go in the first half. That's why you can't stop when there's a flag down. You never know what might happen. There's a timeout up in St. Clair. Quick commercial break here. And we're back. Craig Morgan take the face off at the center. This is Pat Welch. And this is Steve Donovan. Panther lacrosse. Ball picked up by Mount Lebanon. Panthers playing some good D right now. Gonna have Barthes play some defense here. Some tight D there. You try to put a move on Hideas. Can't do it. Up to Craig. Playing some good D. Shot. Lefty. Not good. Mm. Wide left. Seen better shots. Ooh. Nice play. Oh. oh. Flag down. That's not Cheap flag down. I'm not sure if that was a penalty, Pat. What do you got to say about that? I think he tripped on purpose. I mean, I don't think there was a stick even in the round. I mean, if you're going to draw a flag, that's where you got to do it. But that was a bad call, in my opinion. Me too. Yeah. Panthers are going to be a man down for the next minute. 
Ben Gass going to be on the field right now. I believe that it's Panther offense or defense will be okay. I believe they're pretty good on these uh, man Find down good situations. Zone. Yeah, they play some good zone defense on this man down opportunities for Mount Lebanon. They're quick on their feet. And the shot is going to be score Mount Lebanon. It's a nice shot by Mount Lebanon. I'll give him that. The score now is 3 4 Mount Lebanon. With well, four minutes and 18 seconds left in the first half. And I'm surely going to take a face off at uh, Mike Andrigi. And that's it, because Panthers are. Oh, Panthers are up. Nope, they're back to even. Bobby Snyder, far line. Best defenseman ever. Long pull. Long pull. Excuse me. Some may say that. Base off's gonna be oh, oh. I thought that was gonna be one by percent clear. He swings and whips. That's a loose ball push black. It's gonna be be a white ball. I don't think that's the right call. Explain to people uh, what a loose ball push is, Pat. Loose ball pushes, um I don't know about them. They're kind of um it's kind of a myth, if you ask me. I don't think they should be uh, in the rule book. But uh hey, you gotta go by the rules, so what do you think about them? Not my favorite thing in the world, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Shoe's gonna be playing some defense, slide out, Bobby Snyder. Oh. Shot deflect off the post, that, and out of bounds. Black be ball. Panther ball. <laughs> pass the uh kiss she bottles a little bit. Yeah, he can get the pass off. Pass over. Gesk. Just going to bring it back out. Gesk's a good player. I haven't seen much of him tonight, though. First line midfielder's been playing most of the game. Hey. <coughs> Bobby and Cradle around by Shuley. Pass up. Oh, missed pass. Oh, nice, nice check yeah. by Ben Gesk. Oh, he's pushed out of bounds. Ooh, no. I see. Pass around to Shuley. Ooh, power line out. We got Shuley, Morgan, Hideas. Zangrelli. Zangrelli, Gorder, and I believe that's Trevor Yeely at the X. They would like to make the score even uh, for halftime. Try and capitalize. There's only and goal. What a shot. These goals have been unbelievable. Who put that one in? I didn't even see that. I did, but I... Can't remember. Ooh. That ball came out of that six so quick, no one even saw it go in. The score is all tied up 4 4 with a minute 20 left in the first half. Shut it. It's not mine. I have to fix it at halftime. And a face off by number 33. Craig Senior captain, Craig Morgan. Craig's been on the varsity ranks since his sophomore year. Good pickup by Matt Hideas. Fast break, I believe. Oh, oh. Ooh, he pulls it back in. Out, I believe. Correct. My bad. Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen. I forgive you. See if they can get one more goal before the half. There's about 50 seconds left. Under the field, we have uh, Tanner Fackenthal. Ooh, a little knockdown there. I think that might be a flaggable penalty. If you're going to call in, that might have been the one to call. Nice clear by the Mount Lebanon goalie. Upper St. Clair fighting to get back on D. Nice check by Matt Vargas. Ooh, that was beautiful. Like we've said before, one of the best defenders ever to come out of the Upper St. Clair school. Sure is. Pass over to Hideas. Ooh, Hideas could have ran him for the shot over there. Pass, ooh, Jeez. wide shot by Zangrelli. There's about 17 seconds left. 4-4. Four, four. So get our camera in to get a shot of that clock for you. Back to the game. Leave. Trevor Yeely will be bringing in the ball for the Panthers, far side. You better hurry, there's not that much time left. Trevor's got the moves, he might be able to pull one in before the game's, uh, before the half's over. 
Round shot. Oh, Ooh, wide shot. And he's leveled by the Mount Lebanon defender. A little cheap shot there at the end of the knee to the back. Sometimes the refs aren't just looking. And, uh, some players can get away with it, but sometimes, you know. You, you win some, you lose some, you know. It's an old saying about Japanese, man. And that's the end of the first half. Upper St. Clair 4, Mount Lebanon 4. We're going to take a quick break and we'll be back to you soon. We got a shot of the Upper St. Clair student section here. Big turnout tonight. That's the biggest I've ever seen in my whole life. Especially for a lacrosse game. All right, back to the field. We got Craig Morgan taking the face off for the Panthers. Number three, Matt Hideas on the far side. Number 17, Bobby Snyder near side. Face-off's going to be won by Upper St. Clair, I think. Nope. I'm not still loving. fighting for it, Steve. All right. Upper St. Clair picks up the ball. Ooh. Oh, and Matt Barkers takes a shot out of bounds. I don't know why there wasn't a flag called. Mm, he was clearly stepping out. Got hit right out of bounds. I think the refs are going to... Uh, I think these refs might be from Mount Lebanon. I'm not sure. I'm not sure either. Ball well, being passed around by Mount Lebanon. You can't have a ref going for one side because the other team probably gets real gypped off. Mm, tell me about it. I've had some of those in my day. Oh, Ooh. nice check by Barkus. Oh, and he rolls on the ground. Real dramatic. Number 22 trying to put on a move. Good defense by the Panthers. Shot saved by Travis. Oh. Sermo put that in his own goal right there. Travis playing good. Oh. Oh, that's nah, not a good idea. Get in the goal. Got to take the shot. Oh. That's not how we do it. Goal by Mount Lebanon. Surely in in the faceoff, number four, Mike Andreghi and 17, Bobby Snyder. Faceoff one by Shuley, coming down the far side. Uh, Bang against him, come on the field. And he's going to slow it down a little bit. I believe their best plan is to give it to uh, Gorder. I think he has a, one of the fastest shots I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. In the last game, he nearly took someone out of the game completely with a shot that hit him. There's one fast shot, if you ask me. You could ask me, too. Ball being played by Andreggi. Pass back to Trevor behind the goal. Back to Andreggi. Hey, hey. Ball around, nice save by the Mount Lebanon goalie. He's out of the net. Oh, upper St. Clair's got to get that ball. Nice D by Shuley. And the ball's kept in inbounds by Mount Lebanon. Jeez. Shuley's really good with his stick checks. Oh, nice play by Barkus, and that's going to be black ball. Oh. That's a terrible call by the ref. That clearly went off white. Well, it's arguing for the ball. Yet the ref's still not going to give it to him. Hmm. Just like we said before, you win some, you lose some. Sure. Now, <laughs> oh, Lebanon passing the ball around. Shot saved by Travis. Deflected out. As I said before, I think Travis is a Ooh, key ingredient. Little ankle team. breaker right there. Shot, another save by Travis. What do you think, Steve? I said earlier, I think uh, Travis is a key ingredient to this team. Do you agree? Hmm, I would say so. Not having him here sure cost the Panthers. And with only losing one game. I think Adam Wicks uh, did a good job as a. Uh, 
Oh, nice check. Another nice check by Barkas. As a varsity uh, goalie. Shot and score, Mount Lebanon. That brings the score to Mount Lebanon 6, the Panthers 4. With 8 minutes and 59 seconds to go in the third quarter. Okay, taking the face off is number 33, Greg Morgan. Number 3, Matt Hedeus. Number 17, Bobby Snyder. These players have been out most of the game. Must be pretty tired. That uh, Nate Bishop out. He's injured right now. Yeah, I believe he got hurt in the game last night against Franklin Regional where the Panthers won. Sure, sure they gave the... Uh, I, I hear from my colleague that uh, Nate Bishop got a concussion last night. Minor I, concussion. Minor. Excuse me, minor. That's a big part of it. Good thing we take those concussion tests to let us know if we're hurt. Of course. I believe we had a problem with the clock. Yeah. yeah. Back to normal here. At Panthers with the bot X passing it around. Matt is on the goal line. Looking. Can't find it. Cutter. Ooh. Gonna hit Gorder on that pass. Fans have been playing very well. Shot still, a nice save by the Mount Lebanon goalie. Rebounded. Everyone in a scrum fighting for it in the middle of the field. Except for that one player who's just waiting Ooh. there. Ooh. Mount Lebanon player gets knocked down. Hey, shut it. Got about eight minutes left in the third quarter. I believe that's Panther ball. Gorder. Good. Probably take a tag. Oh, he's gonna shoot. Oh, no. Oh. Denied. Yet Morgan comes up. Oh, and he checks the ball right out of the goalie stick. That's clean and legal. Shot oh. score! Craig Morgan! It all happened too quick. Goal, Craig Morgan. I believe that's his first or second in the game, Pat. I believe that's his first. Hmm. Good play by Morgan. We got his brother here. We can say a few words about your brother's play. I think it was good. <laughs> That's uh, great. A little happy today, are we? Excellent words. S Steve Morgan himself is a player for the seventh grade lacrosse team. He's moving up to high school pretty soon. We're not sure about their record, but I think they're doing well. <laughs> Correct that. They are 0-3 this season. So. Still struggling for their first victory. Stay strong, uh, seventh grade. Stay strong. <laughs> Better take the face off here. That's Mike Shirley. Mike Shirley with another face off win. He's been turning and burning these Mount Lebanon midfielders all night. I believe so. It's going down to five six. If you haven't told you recently. Over the past About minute. seven minutes and 35 seconds left in the Ooh, third quarter. Flag down. I believe that's going to go for the Jeez. Panthers. Another flag. Ooh, Matt Levin and defenseman angry over that. Mm. Just like we said many times before, you win some, you lose some. That's cool. And we're back to play. Matt Davis with the ball. Back to Trevor Dex. Julie's got the ball. Panthers trying to look for a shot. Gorder, oh, Ooh. he drops it. That would have been a rocket. Nice one-handed catch by Morgan. Back to Shuley. Good defense by number 44, keeping Shuley away from the shot. The shot, oh, Gorder's shot goes wide. That's about a Panther ball. It's going to be black ball. Good call by the ref. Good call by the ref. Ooh, just a little too loud. Ooh, that's going to go. Oh, Mount Lebanon tries to catch the ball. It slipped on the ground. Hmm, mission failed, if you ask me. Ooh, 
Somehow Matt Lemon comes up with the ball. I'm not sure how that happened. Two men slide to him. He spins wide open shot. Save! Ooh. Save by Travis. That's what I Ball like. cleared. Upper St. Clair going to. Uh, That's pretty kind of. Yeah, he's just going to slide That's down a little bit. Excellent save by Travis. He stuffed him. Hmm. Just like a Thanksgiving turkey. Shot oh. score! What a shot by Trevor. He is quite an exceptional player. Mm. Indeed he is, only a sophomore starting in the varsity ranks. You gotta be good to do that. I believe he has two or three goals, I'm not sure. Could you verify that, Steve? I, I'm really not sure. Maybe you should pay attention more. We're, we're Test our cameraman. Up. Cameraman, is it two or three goals for Trevor? I think it's three. Good comment. It's our cameraman, Theo Schneiders, bringing you this prime time viewing of this lacrosse matchup. This, be, this has been a close game throughout. Morgan, Morgan's going to oh, fly past the defender and miss the ball. Scores now 6 6 with about six minutes left in the third. 11 defender looking for a clear. Hits number 22. Bobby Schneider's going to pick a man up. Bobby's been playing some good D. As right. I said before, he's one of the best. Last night during Franklin Regional game, he single-handedly shut down their leading scorer. Excellent play by Bobby. Excellent play. I was there to see the first quarter. In the, um, I think that was a good uh, pass, pass over. Good Saved game. by Travis. Jumps on top of the ball. Hades, taking on two guys. Oh, he just shakes and bakes. And Gorder just finishes it off. Right, oh, can he do it? Can he do it? Oh, pass out. Shot, oh, nice save by the Mount Lebanon goalie. Mitty's hustling back to play D. Has a ball up top. Let's see me leave a ball after the shot. Good defense box. Kiss behind the net. Driving this man out. Good check. Drops the ball. Ooh, another good check. The defense is definitely their strongest area. Some I would have best. to agree. We've got some of the best in the area. Just locking up their men, not getting a shot. And uh, not only do they uh, play defense, but I, I believe some of them can play a little offense and a little pitch and catch in, uh, on the offensive side. I believe so. I've, I've, I've seen it done. Matt Bark is just known to be. Been known to toss a rock on the offensive side of the ball, if you know what I'm saying. I've seen Alex Kisha even score a goal one time. That's impressive. Shot blocked by Barkus. Ricocheted off his helmet out of bounds. It's going to be a white ball. <laughs> ball at X. Passed out to number 22 for Mount Lebanon. Man coming on, number 18. Kiss just waiting. Ball is still being passed around. Not much action by the Lebo offense. Trying to pull a move. Bobby pushing him out. Shot saved by Travis. It's, it all comes to the defense, and uh, I think Bobby Schneider did a good job. There's something, some call in the field. I'm not really sure what that was. I believe there might be a legal procedure on, um, white, on white. I'm not sure, Steve, but maybe we can just keep on going here. It'll be black ball. Nice pass over to Alex Kish by Matt Barkas. Ball down, but he, he retrieved it. 
A nice little underhand dump to Shuley. That's how we do it. As I told you before, they can play offense. A little uh, pitch and catch out there. Number 99 trying to find his man. Shot. Takes one to the buddy. That's got to hurt. You always got to... He's trying gotta, to throw these slap checks, but they're not really working against Gorder. You always got to have a defender on uh, Gorder. He's got one of the fastest shots, and he'll, he'll get you. Fastest shots ever, possibly. He'll get you when you're not looking. And we got a uh, flag raining yellow. Lebo. Let's see. Oh, Shuli. Save. Oh. Someone just got laid out by Shuli again. And I believe that'll send number 18 off the field for a minute. Craig Morgan's going to come on the field. Calling the play is uh, number 18 with the slash. It's a one-minute penalty. Panthers will be up on a man-up opportunity here. I think they can deliver. I hope so. We'll get them the lead. With the game tied here. 6-6. Six to six. Two minutes and ten seconds left in the third quarter. Shuley around. Oh, Just shot missed. saved by the Mount Lebanon goalie. He's been making shots all day. I'm talking about tr Trevor. You. I believe he has three so far. Indeed he does. All being worked around. Panthers have got to work quick. They're Man up opportunity. As I told Whoa. you before. Oh, I completely missed that, Pat. Why don't you fill us in on what happened? Well, the defender wasn't looking at Gorder, and Gorder just slipped it right by him. It went so fast, the goalie didn't even see it. Mm. It's that laser shot that he's got. Sure is. <coughs> Score now is 7 6 Panthers. On the field, we have number three, Matt Hedeus, senior captain, and number 33, Craig Morgan, senior captain. I believe that's, uh, this is the first Panther lead. Are you, I, I think it might be. I'm not positive. That's a... Let's, 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 <laughs> let's ask for Cameron. Cameron, is this the first Panther lead? Yes. Thank you, Cameron, for keeping us on top of the game. Can they, oh, uh, I thought they could do it again. They probably will, but... That time it just didn't happen. Dave Zangler gonna try and check his stick on and mm. swing and a miss. Somebody's gotta play some defense in number 22. They're just letting him run down the field. Finally, Craig picks him up. Craig's a good defender. Got a whole man piled up right in the crease. Up oh, and now they're just all spreading out like eagles there. There's one minute and five seconds left in the third quarter with Panthers up one goal, seven to six, over their arch rivals, Mount Lebanon. I'm not sure if it's arch, but they're pretty big rivals. I'm pretty sure it's arch rival. In fact, I'm positive. That's great. Back to the game. Ben Guest makes a pass back to Trevor. About 54 seconds left. Trevor's looking, makes a pass back to Guest. It's up to Shuley. Over to Andre. Andre is kind of trying to get her done before halftime. So. Indeed. Back up. Ooh, Gorder wind up for that. He's Thirty ready. seconds left in the third quarter. He's calling for it behind the net. Trevor's calling. No one's answering. Oh, Ooh, that's checking the head, and it's raining yellow flags again. Shut up, miss. See. Violent slashing here by the Mount Lebanon defenders. They gotta keep their sticks under control. I think this is uh, one of the most uh, has uh, one of the most game. Uh, excuse me, penalized games. Yes, thank you. Mm, it happens. I just got a uh, chip stuck in my throat. Sorry, folks. I see. There's a timeout called in the field, and we're back to play. And we're back to play here. Upper St. Clair with the ball. 
18 seconds left in the third quarter. They got to get something moving before time runs out. I think they will. Let's hope so. Oh, Gordo wound up for the shot again. Got 10 nothing. seconds left. 10 seconds left. They might just hold it and try to get possession down here for the fourth quarter. Oh, he does nope. my... Oh. Mm, wound up again. He's got him scared. <laughs> yep, and it's the end of the third quarter. The Panthers up one, seven to six against Mount Lebanon. It's a girl thing. Yeah. Yes, do it. Heaven, do it. Heaven, we gotta go. And we're back here at Upper St. Clair Stadium. This is Steve Donovan. Bad Welch. Panther lacrosse. Panthers will retain possession in the Mount Lebanon end because they held it at the end of the third quarter. Ball will start over with Mike Shuley. Ball being passed around. Over. Just a little playing catch here with Mike Shuley. Oh, miss, miss pass. Let's see if Morgan can get that. Yep, and it's picked up by Upper St. Clair. Ooh. Oh, and he's cracked. But he's okay. Ball back to Morgan, looking for a pass. Ball being passed around, back and forth. It's like playing catch out here. Oh, Morgan went for the, he's looking for the fake shot pass. Goalie out of the net in bad position. Good thing he didn't get caught in that. Davis has the ball right now. They're just, they're just playing catch. He's going in, shot, oh, wide by Gorder. That laser shot just went wide flying. right, actually. You gotta be clear when you say it. too high or wide. Excuse me, folks. Wide right. High right. Ball being brought in. Shuley with the ball. Pass over to Morgan. Back to Shuley. Upper St. Clair's been playing catch with this ball the whole fourth quarter so far. It's back and forth, back and forth. Ooh, Ooh, wide look. shot by Trevor. A little quick stick there. Mm, in look. fact, it was. When hockey, they call it a one-timer. It'll be black ball. Bring it in. Excuse me, cameraman. I think it's very cold. <laughs> mm, indeed it is. It's a little chilly, a brisk 40 degrees out here tonight. Oh, missed pass by Morgan. It's okay, though, because he picks it up. Too bad we don't have an announcer's booth where we could be nice and warm and toasty with hot chocolate. Lippy. With marshmallows, too. Just playing catch. Ooh. And it's all right. Morgan dropped the ball. Here with 10 minutes and 15 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Panther seven, Matt Levin in six. Spender with the ball, passes it up. It's gonna be meet by Dave, Dave Zangrelli. Just missed. Need to put a hit stick on this guy. Indeed. Now it's my Lebanon's turn to play a little catch around here. Just gonna try to get one on one on Bobby Snyder. Nice D by Bobby Snyder. Shot wide. Good D by Barkus holding out his man. Man slid in, ball down. Pick up by Barkus, tossed. Oh, uh, illegal push. Oh, good call by the refs on that play. Indeed. Sounds like the Mount Lebanon fans aren't happy about it. Indeed. <laughs> Can you hear that, folks? <laughs> Can't the ball right now. Shuley with the ball. Defender's just poking away at him, but doesn't seem to be affecting him. He beats his man to the crease, pass, Oh, Bad miss by Trevor, but it's okay.
Pass over the goalie. Goalie's gonna bring the ball up for Mount Lebanon. Somebody's gotta put a hit on him. He's gonna run all the way up the field. Probably should have gonna play some defense here. Ball number 32, gonna be beat, meet by Ben Gesk. Good defensive player, gonna be, oh, shut up in Mount Lebanon and score. That ties it up, seven to seven. Eight minutes and 48 seconds left in the fourth. Let's take a face off right here. Ball's gonna be taken by Craig Morgan. <laughs> we got a special guest here. What do you think about this uh, I'm just saying Claire Levo game? Oh, to pick up a shot. Intense. Oh score by Mount Lebanon. That just that made it more intense, eight, ladies seven, and gentlemen. Mount Lebanon. Mount Lebanon just scored. It's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. Mount Lebanon just scored. <laughs> Sounds like the Mount Lebanon fans aren't too happy about a percent there. Robert Morris, I just... That's a percent <laughs> Ooh, I it's gonna be Mount Lebanon's ball. Ooh, that was my fault. A little pitch and catch here from Mount Lebanon. And it's going to be 33, Craig Morgan playing some D. Need a slide on this guy. Oh, high shot, gun wide. Okay, and we're back. Number 27 with the ball for the Mount Lebanon. Passing it around. Doesn't look like they're trying too hard to score a goal here. Moving pick by Mount Lebanon. It's gonna be black ball. Let's see if they can capitalize here. That's one of my favorite words here. Capitalize. Okay. Back to the game. Great number three. Oh, it's gonna be a bad pass missed by Trevor going out of bounds. It's gonna be white ball. Uh, someone else take over for a couple of minutes. Pass over to number 44 from Mount Lebanon. Oh, and it's missed. It's going to be black ball inside the Mount Lebanon zone. We have our special guest announcer here. Why don't you let the people know who you are? John Siegel. That's good. You, I hear you're a seventh grade lacrosse player for St. Clair. Yes, I am. That's good. All right, number nine, Brian Gorder is going to bring in the ball for the Panthers. Pass over to number four, Mike Andreggi. He's held up on D, still has the ball, picks it up. Pass behind. Pick the shot. Oh, wide shot again by Gorder. Sh shot shows the laser. What do you got to say about that, John? Yes. Shuley bringing the ball, passes it back to Trevor. Back over to Shuley. Upper St. Clair's just playing a little pitch and catch out here. Craig's, oh, Craig's sliding in there. No one passing the ball. Gorder coming around. Shuley just holding it in the X, waiting for something. Beats his man around. Oh, he makes the two def Mount Lebanon defenders hit into each other. But is found at the bottom of the pile. Slow break from Mount Lebanon. Good defense by the Panthers hustling back. What do you got to say about that, John? 
Yes, that was a nice hustle. How much do you pay for oh. I don't. <laughs> Bob, Kish with the ball. Nice. Ooh. Pass is just a little far. Good defense by the Panthers there to get the ball out of there. It's going to be Mount Lebanon's ball. Dave Sangrell is going to play some D. Oh, he got, just got faked out of his pants right there. <laughs> Bob being passed around. Some defense by Barkus. Just waiting for the man to try and come in. Oh, nice tr <laughs> trying the swim move there. Didn't really have an effect on Snyder. Barkus, the D. Well, I'm just trying to make a cut, but they just can't seem to get to the goal. No, they cannot. That is some great defense by St. Clair. Not really sure what the call was on this play, but I believe it's going to be Black's ball. Barkus with the long pass to no one. It's all right. However, St. Clair's D will just have to lock him down one more time. Gordon's gonna play some D on him. <laughs> oh, Gordon with a nice try to push him out of bounds, but it was unsuccessful. Johnny's gonna be signing out. My colleague Pat's gonna be coming back. Good announcing, Johnny. Hey, I'm back. This is Pat Welch. Pat Lacrosse. Nice save by Travis. Ball's gonna be behind. You wipe off. I'm not really sure what the oh, ball in the field. They're going to stop play so they can get it off. Shut up. Yeah, seriously. It's going to be White's ball bringing in. Nice poke checks by Kish. White's going to come and try to put a move on Andreggi, but nice play. Good D shot saved by Travis. I think this Panther defense can let Upper St. Clair's going to have to get the ball out of here. They're down by one and need to. Nice catch by Barkus. It's an excellent catch, Pat. What do you got to say? Oh, but he loses the ball. It's all right. He's going to play some D on the D. A little pitch and catch out there, just like you said earlier. Whacking at the hands of the not Lebanon defender. What's the call? Oh, timeout white. They're not allowed to call a timeout there. I, I didn't believe they had possession on that. I don't think so. Another bad call by the ref. Hold on. You gotta go in five. Four. And we're back to play. It's gonna be a white ball. That's a bunch of baloney. Hmm, I would say so. Number 44 is going to take it up for Mount Lebanon. I'm not really sure what's delaying the game here. Dude, the ref is talking that? to one of the defenders. Hmm, that's what it looks like. Indeed. I'd have to agree with Mount Lebanon fans on this. Start the game. Indeed. It's taking too long here, folks. Oh, and we started it on our way. The goalie brings up the ball, makes it pass number 18. It's okay, though, because Mount Upper St. Clair will play good defense. Cameron's a nice shot. Timeout White again. We'll be back after this commercial break. We're back to play here at Upper St. Clair Stadium. 
Panthers seven and Mount Lebanon eight with three sec three minutes and forty eight seconds left. Uh oh, wide open shot, save by Travis. That's beautiful. That goalie one oh one right there. Maybe one oh two. Take some notes. I don't believe I'm a goalie though, but I will take him anyway. Well, it's going to be worked around by number four. I understand Claire's got to get this ball. Or they're not going to get the goal and tie the game. Indeed. 11. Oh, just keeps on wide shot. But this good D is knocking their sticks out of the way. I keep their shots wide. They sure are. Uh, number eight from out Lebanon with the ball. Oh, excuse me, that's number 18. Ball down. Nice check by number three. Oh, another nice check by Barkas. Another nice check by oh. number three, Matt Hideas. But I believe that's a penalty. Mm. Loose ball push. Indeed. Okay, <laughs> and then ball's back in, number 18. Is Number 12 of the ball, passing it back out. It's good D's keeping all the people from Mount Lebanon out of the crease. Good work. I think they might uh, try a nicer here. Up, and it's going to be knocked. Oh, pass back over. Number 27 from Mount Lebanon. I think this Panther defense needs to play a little tighter. Someone's got to put a hit stick on him. They're just letting them get wide open looks if they just aren't taking the shots. For instance, a few seconds ago. That's good, Zach. Oh, he's going to try one on one. He's going to be a double fender wall. Good defense by Morgan. Passing to the middle. Nice There's... poke check by Bobby Snyder. Excellent defense by the Panther. Panthers. Indeed. Good work. This, this, Panther, this Panther defense needs to get that ball to score quick. There's only two minutes left. And with the Panthers down one goal. I'm running out. <laughs> Indeed it is. Good call. Panther ball. Panther ball going the other way. There's a timeout on the field. It's Mount Lebanon 8 up for St. Clair 7 with a minute 51 left. <laughs> and we're back. One fifty-one left. Black ball. Good cradling by Brennan Serma. Oh wait, no. Excuse That's me. Barkis. That's Barkus. Oh, he's gonna chase it down. Number three. Fatty Davis. What a play. You what? don't see that much. Time left. One thirty-five. It's getting intense here. What do you got to say about this? Special guest, Brian Matthews? Uh, I think we'll pull it off right here. Some big play maybe coming up. Oh, oh shoot wide again. shot. Actually bounced we'll high over the net. Next possession, maybe we'll be able to pull something off. Hopefully. Thanks for your uh, opinion, Brian. We'll see you later now. Craig Morgan with the ball up top, passes back to Gorder. Gorder with that laser shot, might be getting the tan goal. I think this Panther offense is good under pressure. So let's see what they can do. I think the David Bowie sound, under pressure. Julie, spinning, rolling. Pass it. Oh, Gorder's open for the laser. Put it in. Ooh. Gorder's got to get that. He's got to get He's gonna it. going to play good D by Barkus. Yeah, good oh. job, Barkus. Keep it out of there. Eh. Barkus keeps it out of the offense, defensive zone. That's how we do it. This Panther, needs, Panther defense needs to play real tight right now. There's 53 seconds left. Panthers have got to get something going, or this game might be over. I'm not saying anything yet, if you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. I've seen miracles happen. I see. 1980 U.S. hockey team. Indeed. With Kurt, Ru <laughs> Kurt Russell. Good D by... Oh, someone's got to put a hit stick on him. Or this is... Someone's got to put a buddy on this guy. Or he's just going to run out the clock. They got to double him. They got to double him. 35 seconds Good left. call by Brian Matthews. They I like need that defensive a triple call. team him here. 
He's, oh, come on. Put a body, put a body on this guy. Oh, he stepped out of the box. That's really gonna cost him on that. that that's a great call for the referee today. I'm probably gonna look at that. They still got the ball. 16 seconds left. No! Oh, Gordon just knocked it out of bounds. That might have been the dagger in Arthur St. Clair's heart, but there is a flag down. Ooh, that, that's gonna cost him. They're a, they're a man down in this last possession of the game. This is Upper St. Clair ball or Mount Lemon ball? I'm, I'm not sure, I think it might be Upper St. Clair ball. Let's see if they can do in this This last. is an extremely exciting this end. Theo, what do you have to say about this? I'm standing up right now. I'm here. gonna feel a big goal from Gordon back door. Back door, indeed, back door. I'm standing up here. It's Fans really are on their feet. This last 12 seconds in the game. It's getting intense out here. She sure has. Need a hot cup of coffee, though. You could cut the tension in here with a knife. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, my God. It's surely, surely. With the ball. Looking. Someone needs it. Go! Go, Upper St. Clair! Three seconds left. What a shot! He's gone. Three seconds left. This crowd is getting Excuse insane. Me, ladies and gentlemen, for screaming in the mic, but that was simply amazing. Oh, Look at the student section go crazy. One of our, one of our uh, people in the audience is dancing like crazy. Oh, you should see it. <laughs> do you believe in miracles? Yes, I believe. Yes. We do believe in miracles. I'm just saying, Claire fans are doing wild. Trevor, uh, yay! Eight eight in the fourth quarter. Three seconds. I believe left. Trevor's first job as a paper boy. That was a headline stealer right there. Indeed, Steven. Indeed. The Overtime. end of regulation. It's oh. Panthers eight, Mount Lebanon eight. Overtime. Like Pat said, we got an overtime game here, and we'll be back hey, after this. Do you, when did, it, did you turn it on? <laughs> What? Okay, you're gonna comment on Look at that student section up there. I think that's one of the biggest we've ever seen for a lacrosse game. There's a lot of chaos up in there. It's pretty extreme out here. Hmm. This is a, uh, just a recap. This is Pat Welch. This is Steve Donovan. This is Pat Calling this. Lacrosse. Call this Panther Lacrosse game at lovely Upper St. Clair Stadium. We're going to have uh, Brian Matthews review the over overtime rules. Okay, um, the Morgan. game starts out with four minutes. Come on. Uh, the overtime starts out with four minutes. Sudden death overtime, this means first goal wins. So, uh, yeah, it's That's just a timeout wait. wait. No, um, We're going to have a quick commercial break, and we'll be back. For the team. No. no, wait, Brian. <laughs> We're back here at Upper St. Clair Stadium in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. This is one intense game, ladies and gentlemen. We're here in overtime with 3 minutes 51 seconds left. Score tied 8-8. Eight to eight. And This is sudden death overtime, so first goal wins. Nice spin move. Shot wide. Nice save by Travis. It was good to save that because uh, if they would have scored, it would have been all in. It's going to be a white ball. Kish playing some tight defense. Bobby Snyder pick up his man at the top. Uh oh, someone's gotta pick him up or he might drive all the way to the goal. Poke. Good poke checks. Shot saved by Travis. It's an excellent save. Kish playing some good D, protecting his goalie. Was in the crease. Mm, good call, good call, ref. Good call. I had just received word there was a fight breaking out between the Upper St. Clair and Mount Lebanon fans in the student section. Police are starting to break up the fans. I'm not sure if it's mm, just like a rivalry. I'd say we go back to the game. Ball passed over to Travis and back to Barkus. Cradling. Good moves. It's gonna be out of bounds. Uh, upper St. Clair's gonna have to play some good defense, get the ball out of here.
There's three minutes left in the overtime. The score tied eight to eight. Spit. What do you think about this overtime period so far? Well, it's been pretty intense. There's been a couple shots by the Lebo players, and uh. Oh, shot score by Lebo. That's your game, folks. Lebo nine, Panthers eight. It was a great game by the Panthers, but a lucky shot at the end gave Mount Lebanon the victory. This is signing off. This is Steve Donovan. I'm Pat Welch. You say classy after St. Clair. <laughs>